Hey, do you want to be a member of Science National Honor Society? Here's how you do it. One, you have to make sure you're a junior or senior. Two, you have to make sure that you've taken at least one honor science class before or during your 11th grade year, and then another before or during your 12th grade year. Three, you need to maintain a B plus average across all of your science classes. Four is a little bit more flexible. You can either be an active member of one of Haverford Science Club, such as Science Academy, Unless, Aware, Robotics, Science Olympiad. There's a ton of options and they're all great. Check them out, join one, you won't regret it. If you're not an active member of one of those clubs, it would also count for you to serve as a peer tutor. You could also complete some independent research and present those findings. Another option is to do some research or an internship with an organization outside of Haverford. As a member, you can attend lectures from officers of the Science National Honor Society, help out with activities run by the society or other science clubs, and attend regular society meetings. If you're wondering why you should even become a member of Science National Honor Society, the answer is quite simple. I mean, first off, you get to be surrounded by other people who love science as much as you do. It looks great going forward, especially on your college application. And we have an induction ceremony where you get a certificate with your name saying that you're a member and then you get to eat food it's during school. It's really fun. Students with GPAs eligible for membership in the Science National Honor Society will be contacted by email later in the semester, so make sure to check your email. Join Science National Honor Society!